You're listening to Spring River Chronicle. Audio on the go. First National Banking Company. Get checking that pays with Super Plus Checking at FNBC. Hollywood too violent even before her latest trip to Hollywood for an appearance on The Ellen Show. Lauren Gray was planning her next performance to benefit the HHS Music Department. March 9th at the A.L. Hudson Memorial Center in Highland. More than 700 friends and family from the Spring River area join Lauren, the Pocahontas native and hearty resident, for the evening's celebration of music, raising over $5,000 for the Highland High School music program. We were very excited to be approached by our school administration about the Lauren Great Benefit Concert, Hope Bruner, co-director for the Instrumental Music Department, said. It was totally unexpected. It's always great when someone calls you and says, Hey, we'd like to have a benefit to help you out. The funds gained from the benefit will be split between the theater, choral, and instrumental departments for Highland High School. We're going to use part of the money to replace some funds that had been pulled from the budget for the Dallas trip, choral director France Self said. Any surplus we have, I'm going to set aside for the next big thing we do. We're constantly trying to get the kids out there and broaden their horizons. The doors opened at 5.30 p.m. and several volunteers set up tables offering merchandise for sale to help raise additional funds. I wanted to thank the vendors for supporting the kids with the koozies, calendars and backpacks, and all the sponsors, Lauren Gray said. The school janitor at the end was so sweet, I felt bad for him having to clean the gym by himself. While attendees patiently waited for her arrival, Lauren took a few minutes to spend time with some of her fans on the floor behind the scenes. My favorite part was the kids. I want to thank them for coming and making my night, Lauren said, referring to a presentation made by three multiply disabled children, two of them accompanied by their parents, before the show began. The children came to present Lauren with flowers, and to spend some time hanging out with their hero according to the parents. One of the three even presented Lauren with a donation to help her in her success. The kid giving me those flowers made my whole night, Lauren said. I love kids. Mom always thought that's what I should have done when I was trying to figure out what to do with my life, Lauren recalled. I always wanted to do music, but I always loved special education. When Lauren had finished on the floor, she made her grand entrance from behind the crowd, greeting fans as they rose to their feet, cheering and congratulating her as she made her way to the floor. When I was walking down the stairs and everyone started screaming, I immediately started getting emotional, Lauren said. As she began the evening's performance, the crowd roared with excitement. Some singing along with Lauren as she sang, while others gathered to dance on the floor to their favorite songs. Several songs into the concert, Lauren took a break to recognize her mom. I could hardly talk when I was trying to talk about mom, Lauren said. It was kind of an emotional roller coaster for me because I've been sick. It was so much fun, I just wish I would have been less sick and a little less emotional. After the performance was over, Lauren autographed items purchased at the event to help raise money for the school's music program. I'm so thankful that Lauren was able to be here and do it, and the turnout was wonderful, Debbie Gray said. When Bet Bess had a benefit and John Hama had one, people came to support them. It's wonderful how people love to come and donate, and support their community, and can enjoy music like that. According to theater director Shono Covington, the concert will help to open doors for the theater department. The funds will allow us to grow our theater department, Covington said. I loved seeing how excited the area kids were about having the concert. You could just feel their excitement. Thanks for listening to Spring River Chronicle, audio on the go. Be sure to subscribe to the paper and check us out online at myspringriver.com.